the green light of the top one. Green light of the third. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Rusty, move on track, and Rusty is for four to take clean up there, come on, he's up to race track, and 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 he's up to Hello everybody, it is me once again, JG24, JM26, with another This Week in NASCAR Stop Motion. So this week was much better content-wise. There was a lot of stop motions out there, and I really appreciate that, everybody trying to join into the community. And while I cannot shout out everyone, I will do my best to continue to uh, try and promote this wonderful community we have. And just like last week, we'll start off on my channel. Currently, I'm at 17,580 subscribers, so we are growing constantly, and I'm so thankful for that. So if you're new to the channel, this is what I do. I create stop motions. Um, every once in a while, I'll uh, upload some diecast videos or some other kind of NASCAR content, and I also try and promote the stop motion community as a whole. I have been on since, um, this will be my ninth anniversary coming up soon. I'm not sure the exact date, but I know February 2010 is when this whole thing started. So it's been fun. It's been a fun ride, and I look forward to many more years in this community and trying to grow everyone. And just like last week, we will start off with a delicious meme. And it's this week. It is our uh, one of the best memers out there, what incarnation. And we'll just sit back and enjoy this one. Yeah, sorry about the uh, the uh, the audio. I should have warned you about that. Uh, what incarnation likes to troll everyone with that? So first off, we will do um, my new segment of the show since it's two weeks old now. Um, this will be the stop motion of the week, and the winner goes to good friend Eminem Cup Series. He put out a really good stop motion. It's round two of his playoffs, and it's getting down to it. There's drivers that are on the bubble. And they need to make this playoffs work for most of them. All right, so we're at San Diego. His Minecraft two, uh, 300 racetrack, Dale Jr. He's on the pole, and as you see, he's negative 27 points out. He had a bad, bad weekend, and now he's in a hole, dug himself a hole here. And Brad Kozlowski obviously won last week's race, or a couple weeks ago, that is. And they take the green flag here. Dale Jr. and William Byron both get out to good starts here and your teammates junior will take the lead and he leads uh, the majority of this race and i will not spoil who wins the race possibly dale jr does to get himself out of that hole but jr did a great job driving this race kyle bush was a factor in it chase elliott and kyle bush had a feud uh they were factors in this race so lots of good stuff going on here by eminem cup series dale jr he's going to give up the lead to his teammate william byron there and then there's Ryan Blaney plus 12 in the chase. He was a factor at the end of this one, too. Lots of points implication in this race by Eminem Cup Series. Just an overall great stop motion. See how smooth it is. Good camera angles, good camera transitions there. Uh, William Byron uh, using the high lane. There's Eric Jones going lower. Jones is going to try and take the lead here uh, coming to the start finish line. And that's, oh, then there's a wreck. So you have a good wreck here. Matt Kenseth gets turned around by Chris Buescher. And just chaos ensues. And that was Eminem Cup Series Stop Motion. Go give him a subscribe and watch his stop motions because you will not be disappointed. He makes great content, and that is why he is the stop motion winner of the week. And then, obviously, uh, if you are subscribed to this channel and are watching this video, you most likely have seen this one. But I put out a stop motion this week as well, I believe it was yesterday. Um, I've had a different week. I guess I can say that why we start this video. Um, so last Thursday, I went to upload a video at like 9 a.m. And I realized I could not get into my account because somebody hacked it from Morocco. I don't know why, I don't know how, but they did. And 
Oh, um, so. I can't contact the Google, today. got it all figured right, out, and thankfully, so that was panicking. Uh, thankfully, I got this back. Race. Or else I would not be posting this video right Adam now. Stevens. So it's, it's scary, but hey, that's that sometimes car. how the world works, and thankfully, I got this count back, and here we're going through the drivers to watch for part of the opening laps here. We'll go to Kyle Bush when he almost hits a rock, is what uh, track my Master Cup Series is trying to point out to me on Twitter. Is that Kyle Bush almost uh, nails the outside uh, retaining wall, is what I'm trying to say. It's not a rock, it's a retaining wall. The car is in the track. Actually, I use those rocks as weights because sometimes when I paint the tracks, they, they warp. So here comes Kyle Bush, he's going to go wide and. Oh! He almost has Jimmy Johnson. Not the rock. <laughs> Yeah, so there was the first caution of this race. Go and check it out. Um, my Mobile Season 9, Race 11. The ACS is starting to pick up. We're going to have races every week, and I'm so excited about that. And then, um, Nass Hawk. He does NASCAR stop motion random cuts. They're pretty funny. I find them hilarious. And we'll watch the opening scene. It's, uh, it's mocking the um, YouTube Rewind. <laughs> I thought it was pretty good. Brad Kozlowski is Will Smith. <laughs> There he is. You know what I want on Rewind? <laughs> Fortnite and Marquez Brown. Uh, I don't know why YouTube thought that was a good idea. Not, it just, everybody see that YouTube is complaining that it's the most disliked video. And it's like, obviously, people are in like a dislike mob. It's like, no, it's not a dislike mob. The video sucked. Playing out... Just suck. That music. It's not like it used to be, and in my opinion, YouTube Rewind's always kind of been cringy to begin with, so I don't know. I think they need to incorporate more of the bigger YouTubers. Um, I know, obviously, there's lots of big YouTubers out there, um, but yeah, now they're jumping out of the Fortnite bus. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's a crime that PewDiePie's not invited, but I can... I can see why with this controversy, but he is the biggest YouTuber, um, single YouTuber, because T-Series is catching them, but I mean, there are so many people involved with T-Series, but PewDiePie is all by himself, besides his editors, of course, but he's all by himself. Um, for the most part, yeah, which is impressive to me and how much he can reach this community. So yeah, go check out Nas Hawk. He makes good uh, stop motion cuts, and since they are technically stop motion, that's why he's featured in this week's stop motion rundown. And then our boy, we uh, shouted him out last week, and he's already up to 512 subscribers. He was 460 some last week, I believe. So he's definitely growing. Uh, he's giving out a thank you to everyone for getting him over 500 subscribers, but I think that's not enough. He needs to be up in the 10K with um, a lot of us. A lot of these uh, stop motion makers do. I mean, Eric is length and bounds ahead of all of us. He's up to 80K, I believe. But I mean, then again, he makes a lot more content than just stop motions. But don't get me wrong, he has he definitely got famous from his stop motions to begin with. So he makes a great platform for all of his viewers, and we need to give Trackmaster Cup Series, more love. 500 is not enough, man. Get that man up to 1,000. Stat. And then we have the Tim Hortons Cup Series Race 3, uh, or sorry, Season 3, Race 15 from Bristol. Uh, this is a playoff race, a lot on the line, and this one uh, from Tim Hortons Cup Series. And he deserves more subscribers, too. He makes some pretty good content as well. He's got banners on his car. Tim Hortons Cup Series look like little wings hanging out. It's not a disc. You just find it funny. Um, he got Kyle Busch, one of his custom drivers, racing for lead there. There's Alex Bowman because he's plus five. Now he's up to plus eight. Just moving up. Alex Bowman's on the cutoff cusp of here of this playoff he's got going on uh kyle bush is also on the bubble william byron is practically out of this game oh and then we got a wreck between chase elliott and kyle larson that's not good all those fans are fighting and now they're wrecking so definitely go check out tim horton cup series and then we have target cup series and at the beginning of this he posted an apology because the stop motion um, wasn't up to par, and I've had cases like that. Um, I had to redo the final lap of my first ever race at Mobile, now that I think of it. Uh, I didn't like the way the finish turned out, because Kevin Harvick was the real winner of that race, but I didn't like how the last lap turned out, because it was really choppy, and I was in a rush to get it done, and I just sat back. I was like, do I really want to post this? 
Um, so I, I get what you uh, did target series. Um, definitely. If, if you don't feel like this is the best you can do, um, don't post it. I mean, it's your content. It's what you want to put out. I mean, you, you, ho you hold yourself to your own standards. And then um, I like this comment from a fan. Uh, no matter how bad you thought the video was, it's still much better than anything I could do. And that's that's true. You, you have a special talent, Target Series. And I believe uh, you just got to trust yourself sometimes. But like you said, if you don't think it turned out that great, don't post it. And then they take the green flag here. I think he posted up to the second caution. Uh, Ryan Blaney runs into some trouble on this work one uh, trying to get on the road, I believe. Um, pause there. Yeah, he hits the inside wall trying to get to the road. The Ryan Blaney's having problems in the Daytona 500 and the Target Cup Series, and Kyle Busch gets spun out by, I think it was like Murray. I wasn't paying attention, sorry. I was thinking about Ryan Blaney. <laughs> uh, yeah, there's Murray's. Oh, good job, Jamie. You always wreck everyone. Just kidding. I like Jamie. And then uh, some big news for the Miscraft Cup Series. Uh, season 5 is on the horizon. I think we're all excited for that. He's one of the up-and-comers. Uh, has great racks. He announced that Season 5 will have the same uh, quality of racks and whatnot in this rate in Season 5 as they were in Season 4. Um, let's check out a good one. There was I tried to do this last week, but I couldn't find this thing correct. I think it was that Pocono, the one I really liked. And then here's... Oh, this one's good. Uh, Talladega. The Talladega race. Watch Joey Logano. Oh! Oh, no. Uh, oh, guess, uh, what that's is. so cool. I've already, I've already worked on okay, debate time. I know that he he's destroying cars that people could have. That's a big argument. But still, that is amazing. It's something I would never do, personally, because I cannot afford it. But if he can, why hate? He can he can afford to do that. He I think he gets cars for free, is what he said, from somewhere. So if he can do that, do it. <laughs> You're going to grow subscribers. Uh, he's up to 2.3K. Once again, not enough for most of these people. They deserve a lot more credit for putting out great step motions. And I'm excited for Season 5. This is going to be great. Um, uh, I'm really pumped I'm for this. this. I can't wait so, to watch um, it. Um, I, I still need to finish Season 4. Not going to lie. Future. But, hey, and I will I'm do my best to watch everyone. I definitely watched well. this We're race. So this was this race was killer. The dirt track with the hill. Bridge over it. So that was cool. I'm pumped for Season 5, man. Keep them coming. Uh, we're going to have a good time watching everyone stop motions and whatnot. And so that was the second installment of this week in stop motion. Um, just a little shout out to my man. I was wearing his gear for this episode. Got the flag in the background. Got the hat on. Jeff Gordon, congratulations man, on making the Hall of Fame. Been a fan my entire life. Uh, it's, it's been a wild ride when 2015 came on. I was sad to see you go, but I watched every single race, uh, knowing knowing it was your last since those several race tracks. It was a good time. I'm happy you made the Hall of Fame, and I hope one day you can take over Hendrick Motorsports and be Chase Elliott's boss. It'd be cool to have my favorite driver uh, ever to be the boss of my current favorite driver, Chase Elliott. And currently, Chase Elliott was leading in a stop motion at the background playing, but uh, man. Good stuff. Great job, Jeff Gordon. Congratulations once again. Uh, you you are my hero. You were my hero for so many years. You still are. And it was great watching you live, winning uh, at Michigan and Indianapolis in 2014. I was there for that. Uh, some of the best memories of my young life. So I thank you, Jeff Gordon, for everything you've done for all of us, all the fans, for the sport as a whole. So, everybody, thanks for everybody for watching. I love this. I love doing this. I love promoting people, and I hope to do lots more different, a lot more different YouTubers next week. Um, keep pumping out those stop motions. It's good stuff to watch. It's entertaining. Definitely good for the eyes, and it's a lot of fun to see this community grow and prosper. Thanks everybody for watching. This is JT24, JT6, signing